Girls Invent team for giving me a chance to speak with regards to International Women's Day. My name is Marion and my surname is Squay. I had my brother die at nine years old. When I was nine, he was 18. And that was a very pivotal period in my life because it changed so much. It changed the dynamics of my family. All of a sudden, my older brother, who was my comfort, my strength, was gone. And I think I chose to swim and not sink. It was very difficult. But I remember staring out the window and thinking that things would never be the same again. But nonetheless, things, things got better with time. I missed him a lot. He taught me my times table, but I remember him with joy. And so things got better. It gave me a str inner strength. It gave me a resilience very young on. Um, if I could tell my younger self anything, my teenage self anything, that would be this too will pass. When I was a teenager, I was teased a lot. I was bullied and I thought that would be the end and be end of it all. But it wasn't. Life went on. I rose from it. I moved on from it. I learned off from it. I learned to be able to mentor people because of it. And so if anyone's going through anything similar at the moment, I want you to know that this too will pass. That there's always light at the end of any any tunnel. And there's a quote by Nelson Mandela that I really live by, which says that it always seems impossible till it's done. If you're being abused, if you're being harmed in any way, reach out for help. And when I mean abuse or harm, I mean just in terms of being teased or being bullied. I'm grateful to be able to speak to girls in this format because I'm a stylist. I'm a personal stylist. I style celebrities for the red carpet. I work with businesses and consult to them about the best way they can do their social media. And I also work for a magazine called It's Fashion. I'm a senior editor there. And all these roles have come together for me because they help me help people. And that's my biggest joy, helping people. So as I'm styling people, I'm helping them be the best they can be. As I'm writing articles for It's Fashion, I'm helping people be the best they can be beauty or fashion wise. And as I consult with businesses, I'm helping them be the best they can be. If I could give any message to any young girl out there, it simply would be that whatever you're going through, Whatever is happening in your life right now, you're special. God created you for a reason. You're not here by chance. Whatever you're being told, whatever you might think, whatever the magazines might be telling you, you are not here by chance. You are special. There's only one of you. God loves you.